Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to do proof of concept demonstration how to do speech to text recognition in Python 3 on Raspberry Pi 5 single board computer with a microphone built around a Raspberry Pi RP2040 microcontroller. This is Anavi Dev Mic, an open source hardware microphone that I've designed in the free and open source software KiCad. Step number one is to connect all the hardware. For this demonstration, my setup includes a Raspberry Pi 5 single board computer with a micro SD card. I have already installed the Raspberry Pi OS on this micro SD card and plugged it into the Raspberry Pi. I also need a microphone. In my particular case, this is Anavi Dev Mic. I need a mouse, a keyboard, and I need temporary internet connection. Therefore, I'm going to plug the Ethernet cable. Once I have installed all software dependencies, I'm going to unplug it and we're going to have an entirely offline demonstration of speech to text recognition. Finally, I'm going to plug the official Raspberry Pi 5 USB C power delivery power supply to turn on the board. Step number two is the software. I have to install all required dependencies. After booting Raspberry Pi OS from the micro SD card, I'm launching a terminal. And in the terminal, first I'm going to create a Python virtual environment called test. After activating it, I'm going to perform a couple of updates and installations. First, sudo apt update. After that, sudo apt install port audio 19-dev. Uh, this is a required dependency. And after that, I'm going to install all the Python libraries that I need. These are the libraries speech recognition, Pi Audio, and OpenAI Whisper. The source code for this demonstration is available at GitHub. So uh, I'm opening a web browser to, to copy the URL of the repository using the git clone command. I'm downloading the repository on the Raspberry Pi 5. And after that, in directory Anavi examples, speech to text, I have the Python script that I'm going to execute. Please note that the Python 3 script that I have created works only with Anavi Dev Mic. If you're planning to use it with another microphone, you need to modify the Python script. After launching the script in a terminal, it takes a while to initialize all the APIs for speech tech recognition. Uh, when it's ready, you see the text listening uh, printed in the terminal. After that, you can start um, talking and uh, hopefully the script uh, will recognize your voice and convert it to text. So far I have tested it with English only. If you're speaking other languages and give it a try with them, please let me know what are your results. This Python 3 implementation relies on the speech recognition library. This library supports several APIs. Uh, the Google API works great, but it requires internet connection. I wanted to do something with offline speech recognition. Because of this, I selected the OpenAI Whisper um, API with the speech recognition library in Python 3. The source code that I'm demonstrating in this video is available at GitHub. I've shared it there. Have a look at the description of the video for a link. I have already installed all the required software components, so I can now unplug the cable. Uh, I've also turned off the Wi-Fi, so my Raspberry Pi 5 is entirely offline. I have recorded a couple of demonstrations. Here is the first one. Hello world! I'm happy that this demonstration works as expected. Thank you very much for the cooperation.
The second demonstration includes a couple of popular trademarks. Let's see if the speech recognition will work for them. I'm recording this video for YouTube and I want to demonstrate Raspberry Pi 5. Many, many years ago, uh, back in 2008, I completed my bachelor's degree from the Technical University of Sofia in the field of computer systems and technology uh, with uh, software uh, applications of uh, interactive voice response system with uh, voice XML interpreter. The backend uh, was written in C++. I was uh, running it on a Linux server. Back then I was using Fedora, nowadays I'm using uh, primarily Ubuntu and Debian on some of my computers. And uh, back then, uh, the client implementation was running surprise, surprise on Microsoft Windows. I wrote it in uh, uh, C Sharp using the Microsoft Speech API. Uh, back then, this uh, Microsoft Speech API uh, was uh, not doing great with uh, speech to text recognition, but was doing decently well with text-to-speech and I was using the text-to-speech functionality. Fast forward 16 years uh, and today we can see how things have developed rapidly. Uh, I didn't pay attention to this uh, field for several years and it's mind-blowing what you can achieve today. The um, a backend APIs for uh, speech-to-text recognitions are working amazingly good. The Google API is great, but it requires internet connection. And the OpenAI Whisper backend for the speech recognition Python 3 library works offline and shows amazingly good results. It's mind blowing. Even on Raspberry Pi 5, it works very well. Of course, on my laptop or desktop computers with uh, Intel uh, newer generations i5 CPUs, it's working significantly faster, but still it's really cool that you can grab a Raspberry Pi 5 for around uh, 50 US dollars, grab a microphone, for example, one of the dev mic as used in this video, and achieve these results. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. If you're looking for this type of content with Raspberry Pi and other single board computers, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and stay tuned for new videos. See you soon.